was uh, a lot of thought went into it. Once again, it's a juggling act, isn't it? And um, yeah, you've got to have the right amount of experience, but you've also got to uh, find out whether the young people that you've got in your group can cope with the pressure, and there's no bigger game than this one. Um, you know, Alice Park, it's, it's a tough place to play, and you'll find out a lot about our athletes. When did you make the decision you thought this was an appropriate game to play for you the jumps? Oh, a couple of weeks ago, I suppose. Mm -hmm. So you, that was part of your overall strategy for the whole, for the whole Premier Championship? Yep. Tell us about when the game and the centre matured and evolved over the last uh, two months. Oh, obviously, because he's here, so there's got to be some uh, maturity going on. Um, but he, he's, he's someone we're comp comfortable with and, and confident that uh, he can run the cutter and be the driver that we need him to be and uh, he plays up in the line, he's flat uh, and he challenges the opposition so he's done that all season for the Hollanders and that's all we expect him to do, just bring that form to this team and look after his role and and you know that's all he has to do really and everyone else will do their own job. Yeah, well, it makes him a little. E it makes uh, a little easier for Lima, I guess, knowing that Nuggets inside him and they've played all season together, and he's got a pretty experienced bloke outside him. So yeah, he should be okay. I'm picking. Lima, this must be the ultimate sort of test. Well, isn't it? Spring box and Yeah, I don't think it gets much bigger than this. You know. Um, yeah, it's it's a dream come true, and just looking forward to the challenge. How do you weigh up the whole thing without being excited, but at the same time the nerves, the occasion? Yeah, I guess for me personally, it's just how you prepare. And um, all season long, I've just focused on preparing as well as I can. And, and whatever happens on, on the weekend happens. So um, I've just tried to do that and, and stay relaxed. And the boys here are, are pretty awesome. And uh, you know, the coaching staff and management are awesome too. And making me feel welcome. And, so at the end of the day, I just got to go out and know my role and, and everyone else will uh, take care of their own jobs. Does it help that you play here with the Highlanders during Super Rugby this year? So you've got a feel for the place, how the ball flies, and can we expect maybe a drop kick to open the score? Ah, <laughs> uh, you know... Um, Another drop kick, yeah. Super Rugby is a bit different from international level, isn't it? So um, I guess I'll find out in, in the weekend. Yeah, like I said, we'll find out in the weekend whether I belong or not. Um, but you know, um, that super season was was pretty awesome. Um, not only for me personally, but as a team for the Highlanders. And um, yeah, I've got a lot of confidence in my in my ability and and what I can do and. At the end of the day, I just got to nail my role, and and whatever happens will take care of itself. Thanks for watching All Blacks TV. Now, if you want to get even closer, sign up to Team All Blacks. You'll get access to heaps of exclusive content, which means you won't find it anywhere else, including lots of special team offers, match ticket priority, awesome live test match stats, many other team privileges. You can register for free at teamallblacks.com. Join us on the team, and we'll see you there. Yeah, hey, thanks, boys. Come on, boys.